This is question 8. Here we're given a formula used to work out the speed v miles per hour of a car making an emergency stop. Uh, and we're given the formula there. We're told that d feet is the length of the mark the car's tyres make on the road when making an emergency stop. It tells us that a car makes an emergency stop and the car's tyres make a mark 90 feet long. Then we're asked to work out the speed of the car. So this is fairly simple. All that we're going to do is we are going to substitute 90 in for D. So we can say that V will be equal to the square root of 21 multiplied by 90. And so that is going to give us an answer of... So that gives us an answer of 43.47. We're asked to give our answer correct to the nearest whole number. So we'll just call that 43. Uh, and that's uh, what we're talking about there. Work out the speed of the car. So it's 43 miles per hour. Then for part B, we're told that a car made an emergency stop and the car's speed was 50 miles per hour. We're asked to work out the length of the mark on the road. So this time, I know what the car's speed was, and I know that that V was 50. Uh, so what I then need to do is I need to solve an equation where 50 is equal to the square root of 21 multiplied by D, or the length of the mark on the road. So all that I need to do is solve this equation. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to square both sides. That will leave me with 50 squared will be equal to 21d. So getting rid of the square root sign. And then to figure out what d is equal to, I'm just going to divide by 21. So that means that d will be equal to 50 squared divided by 21. So substituting this into our calculator, 50 squared divided by 21, and that's going to give an answer of 119. And so there we're talking about, uh, it says again correct to the nearest whole number, and we're talking about the length of the mark on the road. So it's going to be 119 meters.